Hey guys, Vaughn here. So today we are playing Metal Slug on our Super Nintendo Classic Act here. I've actually already created a save state for this that has the blood included, so you guys don't be getting on to me. Metal Slug by SNK for the Neo Geo, the Neo Geo MVS, that would be the arcade cabinet unit that they put out, and the AES. Now we're actually going to be playing this kind of like the arcade version, so it's insert coin, get your coins ready, or in other words, hit the select button. You know, we're going to, yeah, hell, we're going to need some credits here. And this game's from 96. This is already after the uh, viability, really, of the Neo Geo. So it's already a system in decline. I mean, look at the graphics on this. This, I feel like Metal Slug is the best looking um, series on the console. Or should I really use the term console here? Oh, come on. Yeah, there we go. It's a quality shooter, um, similar to Contra in many aspects, but more of a cartoonish look. I, I feel like it looks really good. You can't backtrack. You got like eight-way movement, and uh, you shoot eight different directions, and you kind of jump and shoot on some guys right there. Yeah, I know it's embarrassing to die at all. I, I have played this at an arcade earlier this year and made it to the final boss on one quarter what why am I dying like that and that was the first time I'd ever played it you know I've heard about this game many times over the years oh shit all right the eponymous metal slug right here all right can I do something with that fish thought that was points bit of slowdown you know this is 1996 game running on like 1990 or 91 architecture and it's pretty impressive you certainly didn't see anything that looked quite like this in the early 90s so you're mostly just like some kind of like man of war who goes around rescuing POWs you get a tank they call the metal slug um, what is it super vehicle 001 you know what they call this I think it also has some uh, bombs it can blast. All right, guys, you want to come down here to me? Yeah, you kind of undo their their binds, and then you can get power ups from them. Now there are oh, I didn't know I could jump. Shit. Yeah, massive slowdown. I realize. Oh, get in there. I think that you can make some adjustments to uh, RetroArch to run this core faster. And then that way you don't have the slowdown. Shit, you gotta jump out. And yeah, I made that look good, didn't I? Alright, we gotta, gotta get up here and grab something. Oh, not going so hot here. Yeah, I could... I realize I could just cheese him here. And there we go. Game's a little forgiving. For another quarter, it's going to get you some, some power-ups. Oh, shit. Why didn't I duck? Ducking action. He can, he's can. he got a lot of movement, this dude. Um, like, see, you can kind of crouch walk... Actually, I think you have to shoot the gun. There we go. I right, picked that up a little too late. I guess the H is heavy machine gun. How did I do? Probably not so great. No prisoner? I, or does that mean no prisoners left? But I got all of them. Why does it say level 4? So it's a mission instead of a level or a stage. This game is two player. I, uh, I'm probably going to try to play this with some uh, little kids during Christmas. Maybe without the blood coat on. 
Oh, can I crouch under that? Nice. But, um, you know, whether it's Metal Slug, Metal Slug 2, 3X, which is the remake of Metal Slug 2 with the, the 3 engine, I think it runs smoother. Met Metal Slug 2, really, really sluggish uh, by default stuff. But they all look about the same. Like, you'd have kind of a tough time telling them apart. Even when once they started putting these on, like, Xbox, they they have a very similar look. Actually, uh, eventually they they lose a little bit of their charm as far as the um, animation, the uh, traditional animation. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. There we go. Come on, tank. Uh, what? Did it even shoot? I'm ready for you. Oh, I guess I must have just cut them all with a knife right there. I'm a little concerned some of this stuff might explode by me. I guess these rockets are homing. Yeah, I'm not going to risk going down there to pick up some power-up. So gruesome the way people are dying here. Yeah, gameplay-wise, I mean, this is a 2D shooter. It's not just some Contra clone. This actually looks a lot better. Contra never really had the art style thing in its favor. The art style in Contra just always differed. I mean, hell, you could look at the, like, the box art and see that they were trying to rip off, like, Rambo... And I think uh, Arnold from Predator poster. All right, let's get down and dirty here. All right, I think it's going to let me jump out of here. There we go. Smooth as silk. This game, yeah, the poster art changed some. But the character designs in the game really didn't. Nicely violent, cartoonish gore thing going for him. Uh, I think when I played this in an arcade, it actually had the blood on, remarkably enough. Did my shotgun run out of shots there? Oh shit, dude, you better get out of the way. Alright, let's light this baby up. Really, you're going to throw balls that slow at me? What kind of relic... Oh, and then I like a goddamn asshole. I going to get killed like that. Yeah, shooting a tank with a pistol, not unlike Tom Hanks and same What? How that did not touch me? That is some bullshit. Yeah, now in the arcade, you're working this with the, the Neo Geo only had four buttons and a stick. I mean, I could kind of see how a twin stick type setup could could be aided here. Gotta jump over these. Oh, son of a bit. You know, realistically, I don't really have to do anything. I could just jam more quarters. Okay, am I gonna embarrass myself here and not jump in there? Oh, yeah, we got POWs. I have not played all the way through this. Um, honestly, this is about as far as I've gone. So, a lot of this is going to be fresh to me, and maybe even fresh to you. But part of this uh, series is really just showing you guys retro games when games were fun, you know. Oh, shit. I almost forgot I got to drink Mountain Dew. Alright, what do I do here? No, oh, just kind of haphazardly gets pushed up when I jump. Yeah, it's like I, I didn't quite jump up the platform, and then the game just kind of like, oh, there you go. Tread pulled you up, I guess. Alright, I guess I picked the right spot to cheese this guy. Oh, yeah, you have some missiles you can shoot out of the, the metal slug. Not that they're going to aim in the right place. I get him? Oh, shit. Jump out. Yeah, I guess your your grenades switch for missiles when you're in there. The grenades are cool. I mean, there we go. We want to nade him up? Sure we do. 
you die, you get your your needs replenished nicely. Shit. Kind of spam both of them together if you want. It looks like you got away. Is that the like uh, big bad of the series? Got away on me? I don't know, I'm asking you guys. Yeah, I don't really know a whole ton about Metal Slug. Um, I just kind of saw that, I guess, a long play will probably take about 30 minutes, so I figured, why not? Let's go. Okay, what's the best way up there? Follow the sign, huh? Hallmark of uh, old 2D games, but the ability to precision jump, right? Oh, boy. Son of a bitch. Oh, you want to bring a helicopter into this, huh? Is that the guy that got away on the train? Yeah, I can recognize your pattern. Pattern recognition. You don't really have to be a real sharp shooter. Oh, nice docking. Oh, shit. Got a bad feeling about that. Oh, Christ. Oh, hey, it was generous enough. Uh, let's see. There's a door. Guess I push that. Need to lift this thing up, huh? Son of a bitch. Oh, nice. Boom. Oh, god, shit. It's just about to praise you, game. Let's move. Five meter spread, we move. Oh shit, the game's not gonna scroll with me, so... Oh yeah, oh shit. What do I got here? Baby birds, points. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. You know, if this game could just scroll with me a little. Now I'm in trouble. Oh shit. Okay. What do I gotta do to make this jump? There we go. Nice. Frog? What am I collecting? Oh, look at this guy. He's like Roadblock from G.I. Joe. Oh, shit. What did, did he whip me with Bandolier? Oh, you want to do this? I guess you do. Son of a... I think he's turning shades. You know what that means. If it bleeds, we can kill it. Mm. Alright, I'm just going to charge this asshole. Knock some bombs into him. Yeah, that taught him a lesson. Or it didn't. Oh shit, I could probably get in that baby bird. We all need to rescue them from the cold. Am I storming their fortress? Oh good, found some turkey, you know, like I've said. Oh shit. Classic gaming health. The turkey. What do I want to do here? Oh, Jesus. Uh, how about some nades? Is that hurting me? I don't know. Oh, come on, let's keep this going. Yeah, baby. Alright, how close can I be to that explosion? When is that going to explode? That's a better question. Yeah. Look at all this horrific death, but it sounded such a great Looney Tunes 
cartoonish type mold, isn't it? I mean, um, kind of relaxing, making guys bleed. Jump in. Let's do this. Whenever Vaughn says let's do this, take a shot. Okay, do I go up? Oh shit, got a guy down here. Oh uh, boy, I guess we're gonna rescue you. What is this, a trap? Jesus Christ. Uh, you cost me my metal slug, dude. Uh, I must be shooting the special ed tank. I love that jump and shoot down shit. Ah, Christ. Are these guys random each time? That I'm not sure. I mean, there's certainly points where it's obvious enough you countered the boss or whatever. I, I don't think that guys just simply keep coming at you if you sit still. I mean, we could try that. Can't out, outrun these. I don't think I'm able to jump a grenade down on him. Okay. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> oh, it must be a boss fight. What do we got? Yeah, what are these guys doing holding rocket launchers while tied up? You couldn't free yourself? You have a damn rocket launcher. Shit. This guy's launching mines at me. Where is he shooting? Oh, Christ. Am I doing this right? Do I push the mines back down on him? Is that the story? Oh yeah, I can kind of shoot the mine and make it hurl back towards him. Okay, so the the grenades will connect. The more you know, do 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 do. Shit, what is that? There are people who get through the console version of this where you actually have lives. You can't just jam in continues. You know, that's something that when they would port these to the home, and it, be it a beat 'em up or one of these type of shooters. Just your lack of ability to keep continuing really changed the difficulty. I mean, the, the games were made so you could just keep continuing, and that that's wherein the difficulty lied. You bring that home and you say, oh, well, instead of a shit ton of continues, you get three lives and then you're screwed. Yeah, the story really changes quick. Let's move. What the hell's going on in this room? The shit. Oh, Jesus. Rockets. Monkey. Do I do I rescue the monkey? How do I get up there? Nice. So that's that's kind of the puzzle trick right there, I guess. Hey, you want to get that? Don't blow up the explosive yet. Oh shit. These guys are they're, they're rotoing the metal slug. Oh, Jesus, why is it letting me scroll back in this? But it wouldn't let me do it in other places. Instead, it just wanted me to fall to my death. Okay, buddy, we're, we're coming for you. Are we? Jesus, okay. Is there... I got it. Let's move. Are we dealing with bigger tanks now? You gotta get out of the slug before it blows up. That's one of the caveats of actually being in the, the metal slug. Oh, these poor guys, they just... 
want to hang in the trenches and, and escape. But I'm not letting them because I'm evil. Oh shit, did you see that? I actually like blew up the the edge of that cliff. Eroded it, I guess. Shit. Damn it. Let's go, shit. Alright, what do I do about this guy? Nice. Did I rescue him? Is he coming over here? Hell if I know. I'm trying to trying to walk forward and shoot this thing, but carnage as far as the I can see you got to have gas if you're going to operate the tank so it has like this fuel thing that goes down there we go uh, I don't know if it counts as a rescue if the guy's untied but I don't run into him for him to give me the rocket launcher and shit here come back Jesus big O tanks as my mom would say Oh, goodness. Can I jump down? Get plowed. <laughs> oh, oh. How do I... What's the best way to damage these fools? Put some credits in there. I guess I could just park on him and just throw an endless amount of nades. I'm sure this is way more frustrating if you play on the, the Neo Geo AES, the home console. There we go. That's the ticket. You want to take a drink? I'll take a drink. Mission 5. Got a feeling we're near the end here. Am I running through, like, war-torn Poland? I think I started out as, like, Vietnam. can't get in that car, can I? But I can wreck this joint. Oh, cool. Blow up the balcony. Grab the power up. Shouldn't have had that shit in your bakery, lady. Shouldn't be parking in the street during the middle of a war, either. Jesus. Christ. I got you, buddy. I don't even know what I just wrecked right there, but I did filthy damage to it. I can't really climb up those cars, can I? Oh, that asshole only has a metal for me. Shit. General Patton would be disappointed. Shit. Oh, is she holding a cat? Just look at the like liveliness of everything going on here. This is just the first game in the freaking series. 
And like all these guys have all of these animations. It's pretty amazing. I think this series is kind of still going. It's been a few years since they had an, an installment, but, you know, try to change the art style up. People didn't like that. You know, little things like that, I think, happened. Try to evolve. You know, everybody wants polygons. You know, this is like near the height of the sprite experience right here. Okay, am I supposed to drive the truck? Didn't say get in. Maybe I, I kind of like haphazardly jump up there. Shit. All right, son of a bitch. Again, I gotta applaud the game for giving me a power up for putting another quarter in. Not just oh hey continue, but here have a gun. All right, what's the best way to deal with this guy? Do I shoot the missiles back at him? Okay, it's not connecting. Shit. Do I blow the car up? You know, just general confusion right now. Oh, the, hey, more guys actually do show up if you take too long. Oh, f shit. I'm embarrassing. Just keep shooting. All I had to do is keep shooting the wall. I'm going to launch some, some missiles at it and try to avoid this tank behind me. You're on your own, buddy. Oh, good. You came down here. You came to the right guy. Uh, dogs run down the street. I can see why. Ah, uh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh. I think there's an enemy like that at the uh, Metal Slug 2 that kind of lifts its tank body up off the ground. Oh, look at the POWs. And I walk into a slow-moving rocket, because why wouldn't I? I guess I got him, and that made his missiles blow up before they could reach me. Japanese text, because I had to upload like the Japanese BIOS to get the blood thing working right. But you can hear it in English. Most of the text is in English. Alright, what am I doing? Am I following those tanks? Am I chasing the tanks or following? Yeah, nades. Always trust the nades. Shit. Man, you can just cut up so many guys with your knife. Yeah, you just walk up to him, you do the same thing as you would for shoot. It's considered a knife. Now let's go down here. And regret it. Actually, you know what I made? It shows correctly. Whoa, Jesus. Did not expect to see planes. Alright, what am I supposed to do against these guys? I feel like King Kong over here.
Got a heavy machine gun. Not gonna be able to use it because I'm busy dying. Okay, there is a snake on the platform for no discernible reason. Yeah, you want some of this? You want some of that? There we go. Oh, oh, come back. Come back, come back, come back. Okay. I jump down here to try to get one of them, pretty much miss all of them. Oh, Jesus. We got parachutes? Guess not. But we have a sub? The metal sub, huh? Oh, oh, this is badass. Now the planes are mine. Oh, shit. I guess all I have is an anti-aircraft gun. Oh, they're in the distance? Okay, I got it. Oh, shit. Uh, it's a little... A little odd having to like circle around to shoot the guy on the right. Shit. Now if you're playing this two player, is there two guns? Oh, oh, I'm trying to, trying to, shit. Okay, we'll take care of that first. Alright, come on, come to Papa. Here, we'll just uh, aim right there and hope for the best. Oh, shit. It's not out of fire. You gotta keep jamming away here. Only got one plane left, and there we go. Oh, now the helis. Oh, shit. You know, I might be better off without the, the anti-aircraft gun. Looks like we're, are we making our way to port here? Pass some mines. Keep joking. Are we crashing? What are we doing here? I'm bringing shit down. Oh, shit. This is so badass. This is really a lot of fun, this game. Definitely an arcade classic. You know, coming in 96, this is in like the death throes of the arcades, like pretty late. Arcades were, I, I believe, on the way in decline in the 90s. You know, destitute by the 2000s, as we have like Dreamcast, PlayStation 2 and such, delivering the, like the Naomi board Arcade, that was embarrassing right there. Why'd I have to fall like that? You know, delivering that uh, arcade board. Arcade perfect experience to the home console. Kind of made a lot of it pointless. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, I made it. Okay, should I even bother with that? Here, let's, let's go about them like this. Oh, come on. Oh, so many missiles. Yeah, there we go. Tredge ever forward, metal sub. What the Christ? All right, good thing I killed him in time. What? Oh, man. Gonna have to hop out. And I completely missed my chance to get that guy, I think. Oh, Christ. I had a good time putting in more quarters. Now look, some of these guys are like dead in the background. What the hell? Where are they jumping from? Jumping at me with knives? Call that a knife? 
This is a knife. Alright, I'm assuming this is the big bad right here. Though we didn't really get a change in music. Maybe he's in first form. I guess I'm just going to shoot up and keep shooting. Come on, I know you don't really want a piece of me. Okay, can we finish killing this guy? Jesus. <laughs> POW just fall from the sky. I guess the game's feeling sorry for me. Now I'm getting a rocket launcher. Alright, how do I avoid that gun? That's a bad place to be for that. So he goes across the left side of the screen and is like automatically on the right side. Get some eat some bombs, buddy. Oh, Jesus. Carpet bombed. I do not like the sound of continuing. Arr. Let's go see what this guy's got for me. Anything? Bombs. So I'm gonna have to get kind of within range. Or get myself killed. Go back to 10 anyways. I'm, I'm gonna have a hard time feeling if I can even if I'm affecting this guy much here. I know I'm just gonna win the war of attrition. There are guys who can like one quarter this on like YouTube. And this is my first time playing. Yeah. I feel like this game's graphics are still quite impressive today, you know? Proper HDMI upscaling on this, just really beautiful. I mean, it's a game anybody can play, but you could also master. Not that uh, there's really too much reward for that. I guess you get more YouTube views if you can master this. Whereas I'm kind of embarrassing myself. I guess I need just a heavy machine gun to deal with that shit. Come on. Yeah, now that's that's a healthy amount of damage right there. Let's do this. Take a shot. Uh, yeah, son of a bitch. Oh, damn, he bled. <sighs> Cheers to you. Oh, final mission complete. Mission all over. Well, I just got mission complete. Now I'm getting mission all over. What, red all over? Oh, shit. Getting 39 continues. So 30... What is it? 40 coins for 10 bucks. So one coin for the initial... I guess it, it cost me 10 bucks to beat this. Jesus. Is that all we get at the end here? Plans for a... 
tank. Ah, shit. Here we go. Paper airplane. Super vehicle 001 metal slug. Oh. I don't know if I'm supposed to feel sad that all these guys are dead. Like, I just. This wake of damage. Was that the one guy I didn't kill throwing this paper airplane that. You know, if you could throw a paper airplane like that, he shouldn't have been a soldier. He should have been an artist and all that, right? It's supposed to make you reflect on war. We have all these people who had better things to do, but I destroyed them. Well, there you have it. Metal Slug from SNK for the Neo Geo, MVS AES, 1996, an arcade classic. I give it a 9.5 out of 10.